Hello everybody and welcome back to my survival let's play series where we last left things off we had actually put some glow berries in our little enchanting area and we had gone hunting for a lush cave to find a spore blossom to hang in here because this area as we know we want to make it more mystical and magical because it is our enchanting area hence the purple Love that sound. Hence the purple tingling chiming floor. However, as you can see, we were not lucky in finding ourselves a spore blossom. But I promised you guys in the last episode that we were going to find a lush cave today. And I intend to deliver on that. But first things first, we have something else we need to do. Special thanks to, I hope I'm pronouncing this right, Scarvin0711, who actually gave us a name for our cow, so thank you very much for that. We are going to jump down here, place our name tag in, and we are going to name the cow. Oop. Bessie. So let's hop on out and go say hi to Bessie. Hello. Hello, Bessie. I, I'll do my best not to kill you whenever I come and visit the cows. But yeah, we are going to go visit and try and find a lush cave. I said in the last episode that we were going to try and head in that direction because I thought we had visited that direction when we harvested, not harvested, when we founded this land. I realize now that that is the direction we came from. But you know what? I'm in an exploring mood, so I think we're going to go ahead that way. But first things first, we need to gather the proper things. I've already got a boat and some leather boots in case we come across an ocean or some powdered snow. However, we do need a few more materials because if we do come across some powdered snow, I want to be able to harvest it. So I am going to make a bucket. There we go. Now, of course, we're going to need a few more things like blocks and whatnot but I think for the most part we're ready so I'm going to gather up a few more things and then we'll be headed on our way hopefully to find a lush cave all right so I've got everything I think I'm gonna need I wish I had a few more arrows but that's why I'm bringing flint because there are no chickens around this area that I can get feathers from so I'm hoping to pick up some eggs maybe a few feathers on the way and make some arrows with the flint and the sticks but otherwise I think I've got everything I need I've got some blocks plenty of food this is for the powdered snow I think I'm ready and we're heading off in that direction that being east so when we go when we come back we're gonna want to head in the west direction let's get started hey look at that we got a beehive Awesome. I'll have to come back for you, buddy, when I have a silk touch pick and a campfire. Cool. That's really awesome. Now, that is a snow capped mountain. That looks beautiful. That is amazing. That is really what I like to see in this update. That's awesome. Maybe, actually, maybe we can get some powdered snow out of it. Ooh, I'd, I'd really, I'd really like that. All right, let's get over there. Oh boy, not my brightest moment. Okay, something's attacking me. Not my brightest moment. Help, 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 help. And, oh, no, 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 not the torches, food. Okay. Something was after me. I don't know what. I'm glad it's gone. All right. I need to be a little bit more aware of my environment and not get distracted by the beautifulness of the new terrain. But we're getting closer to our mountain. I'll let you guys know when we reach the top. Oh, there's snow. We're getting up there. Is it powdered snow? No. Darn it. 
Ooh, this is really nice. Oh no. Oh, I thought I fell. Uh, let me put on my leather boots, actually. Just in case we come across some powdered snow. This is really nice. Oh. Hello. There we go. Got stuck on a block. Not sure why. Ooh, I wish I had a silk touch pick right now. This looks really nice. Is that a goat? <gasps> it's a goat! Come here, buddy. Come here. Come here, come here, come here. I haven't seen goats before in Minecraft. Hello. Aren't you just amazing? I think I can get an achievement. Hey. I think I can... Hey. I think I can get an achievement with this guy. No, no. Hey. Would you quit running? Actually, hold up. No, 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 no. Don't move. I placed... No. You know, people were happy you were in the game. But you're starting to annoy me. Nope. Come on. There's an achievement for putting a goat in a boat, right? I'm not just wasting my time. Would you... Hello? Boat. Oh, now you come back. Goat in a boat. Boat in a... Do you jump? You're still... There we go. Yeah! Awesome. Whatever floats your goat. Look at us. Aren't we a fine pair? Alright, I got my enjoyment out of you. Uh... Don't want to hurt you. I'm sorry. I didn't think that would hurt you. Oh, no. Oh, well. Wow. This is a great view. I would turn up my render distance just a little more, but that's when things start to lag. You're a different goat. You know what? Actually, let me just turn it up really quick, and I'm not going to move. All right, so I doubled the render distance. It was at 12 chunks, now it's at 24. Let's see where we came from. See how beautiful this land is from a different angle and up high. Yeah, that looks really nice. That meadow up there. It's pretty, isn't it? Man, I love the new generation for this game. The new terrain. Let's take a look from over here. Oh, wrong button. Come on. Oh, there's a jungle. That's good. I don't think I have very many jungle saplings. Yeah, we're struggle busting a little bit, but it's loading. Cool. I wish this was powdered snow. I really wish it was. Let's get up to the highest point. I guess that's the highest point, but we're not going up there right now. We're just going to make it to right here. Oh, it's a sparse jungle. Oh, I actually haven't seen these before. And there's a village. I don't see a blacksmith, though. No, this is kind of cool, though. All right, my character's starting to lag a little. Let me turn the chunks back down. All right, back down to 12. That's a lot smoother. I'm happy about that. I hope this video is rendering okay. I know it tends to lag a little bit when I'm generating new terrain. Oh yeah, so you, you can hardly see the, uh, the village now. Now this is really cool. All right, we are heading in that direction still. We're gonna find this lush cave. I promise, I promise. Okay, so I was just mining some iron, because it's always nice to have some more iron, and I noticed this. Now, that's calcite. 
I thought calcite only spawned um around geodes. I didn't I didn't think this was a naturally spawning thing. Um let's go take a closer look at that. Maybe collect some of it. Because calcite is a beautiful block. Yeah, look at this. Huh. That's really interesting. Um yeah, no, I'm really curious about that. Hey, more iron. Um, let me check the wiki really quick and see what it says about calcite. Okay, so according to the wiki, under the natural generation, it says, Calcite generates naturally as part of the structure of amethyst geodes between the smooth basalt and block of amethyst layers. It also generates in the stony peaks and strips. I guess that's what we're looking at here. This looks so cool. Can we get up higher? Look at that. I wonder how far it goes. Hey, and an emerald. I'm going to leave that. Yeah, no, this is super cool. Make the jump. No. Um, come on. Let's find our way to the top. We can do this. And, yeah, there's a lower spot right here. Let's check it out. Ooh, an actual jungle. Ouch. I'm lagging a little bit with this new generation. Oh, bamboo jungle, too. Okay, so the calcite just stops no it keeps going this is really cool oh did you guys see that i need to get back up here i think i saw something i did i saw some crying obsidian it's a ruined portal Let's go check that out really quick. Didn't look too far away. And no, it wasn't. Cool. I hope the rain isn't making this too laggy. Ooh. But I do hope it puts out that fire. What happened here? Why is there bamboo everywhere? Like, like, not this bamboo. This bamboo. Did these, um, conflict with the generation and the portal overrided the bamboo? That's all I can think it being. What am I doing? I got a water bucket. Hello? Give me that back. And I'll take the obsidian. Is there anything I can get rid of though? Um, I can convert this to bread. I need these for chickens. I can get rid of the bamboo. I have some of that at home. Um, I suppose I can get rid of the apples. All right. Let's get to a safer place. Jump, jump, jump. Jump, jump, jump. All right. Let's make some more bread. How much is that going to give us? Oh, a lot more than I was expecting. Ah, uh, not a perfect stack. Oh, well. Okay. We've got some more food. We got a little bit of obsidian, which is nice. Now we can go exploring. Ah, oh, I thought this was a cave for a second. Darn. All right. Let's go exploring. See if we can make it through this dense bamboo. Ooh, maybe we'd even be able to find a panda. That would be really cool. All right. You know what? I am sick of this rain. It's making my game lag a little bit. So I'm going to sit right here and wait for the rain to go away.
Come on. Go away. Screw it. I'm just going to run. I don't know where. Maybe that's where the skeleton's coming from. Um. Hello. Oh. <gasps> Ooh. Glowberries. That means this is a lush cave, right? Oh, that's awesome. How much damage am I going to take? Ooh. This is a lush cave, right? Or am I mistaken? This is just grass. This is just a cave. Wait. Or is it? Still says we're in a jungle. Hello. Oops. Oh, come on. No. This is a lush cave, is it not? Oh, hello. Hello. Wow. We got the walking dead coming after us. Um, I don't want to deal with all those guys. I'm going to turn tail and run. Is this a lush cave? Still a jungle. Oh, no. I thought that was water beneath me. Look at this. This is amazing. Wow. I mean, I thought the deep slate caves were nice. These are really cool. Now, that's moss, right? It's not just the grass tech. Oh, it's Mac. It's not just the grass texture coming through with Optifine. That's moss. That looks like it. Yes! We got moss! I'm just going to grab a couple of these. I know I can bone meal it for more. That's awesome. I'm really happy with that. Um. Hmm. Now, I did come to this place for a spore blossom. But we can pick up a few more things while we're here. I wish we could find an axolotl. Yikes. Um, ooh, we got some drip leaf. That's nice. Don't. Where's my shield? Where's my shield? Ow. No. Bad skeleton. Hello, creeper. Would you mind helping? Would you mind helping me out? Ow, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. come far enough away. Nope. He's still there. Jeez. I don't want to die all the way out here. I got so many good things. I just found the lush cave. Oh, I think he's given up. Yeah, I can shoot too. <laughs> I didn't even drop an arrow. Okay, good. I was worried you had to use shears on these for a second. Cool. Awesome. Uh, get rid of the rotten flesh. Oh, I actually brought shears with me. I didn't even think about that. I actually brought them with me, so it wouldn't have mattered. This is really cool. Any axolotl friends? No? I'd say to head down, but there's mobs. Lots of mobs. And 
Actually, I'm here for a spore blossom. I should be looking up. I don't see any. Do you guys? Oh. Maybe we need shears for those ones? Which ones were those? those these ones, right? Um... Oh, well, can we toss away? I got rid of them. Where are you? I hear you. Leave me alone. Small drip leaf. I'll give you guys some light so you can see. I'm sorry I keep doing this. I just got a new mouse. Small drip leaf. Huh. Wait, where's my... Where's the other drip leaves I gathered? Oh, right here. I'm blind. Oh, these are really cool. I know the axolotls will only spawn in darkness, but I want to be able to let you guys see. I want to give you guys the ability of sight. This is cool. Not the best lush cave, but it's my first lush cave. So I'm happy with that. But we're here for a spore blossom. And I'm not leaving until I find one. The lush cave doesn't continue down that way, so there's no point in going down there. Um, I guess I'll just keep going around until I find something. Wish me luck. We did it! We found a spore blossom! It took a little while, but we found it. Now, I'm going to be careful. I don't know if you can break these things without shears, so I'm just going to use some shears. Oh, I thought I lost it for a second. Um, what can I get rid of? I don't need a nearly broken iron shovel. Give me that spore blossom. Give it. Yes! We got some moss, we got a spore, bo spore blossom, and we've got some drip leaf. We got everything we could ever need out of this cave. And we can find. Ooh. Sorry, remember I said I get distracted easily in the last episode? I wonder if there's any oxalotls down there. I said we got everything, but if we can find an axolotl too. That would be the absolute best. I unfortunately don't see any. Which is kind of bumming me out. I suppose we can always come back for more. But yeah, we've got pretty much everything we could ever want out of this lush cave. So, I've already marked down the coordinates of where it is in case we ever want to come back. This is amazing. All right. I'm going to make... There's another one. All right. I'm not leaving with just one. I'm going to grab that second one. Ooh. I thought I fell off the edge for a second. Get out of my way. Oh, if that goes... I'm going to have to jump down there to get it anyways. Come back. Sp Spore Blossom. Spore! Spore Blossom? No, globe. There it is. Hello. There's glow squid down here. I guess that's another sign that there's no axolotls, huh? Oh, quit jumping. Yeah, I'm not ready to deal with all these mobs. Um. I'm just going to pillar on out of here. I'll see you guys back at the surface. Oh boy. I was worried that was going to happen. Oh boy. Nope, nope, no. I do not like skeletons for reasons like that. Uh, what are you doing down here? 
All right, let's find a new area to pillar out at. One that we can't get shot from. Let me place down a torch just so you guys can see. That was... Oh, it's, he, tur he turned into a drown. That was a terrifying noise. I'm just going to block myself in a little bit. Oh, those drones make horrible noises. Okay. Let's get out of here. Alright, we have to be digging up in a mountain. I am at 111 blocks and I still haven't reached the top. We've got to be in a mountain, but we've also got to be relatively close. There goes my pickaxe. We've got to be relatively close, right? Oh boy. I'll let you guys know when I reach the top. We made it! Finally! Oh, we're out of the caves. And it's daytime. That's really nice. Alright, I'm just going to mark this for future reference. Oh, we made it out. Now the question is, which way is home? I think... East? I'll have to check that. I'll let you guys know. Oh, alright. I'll meet you guys when I'm back home. Oh, oh, oh no. No, 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 no. We found some powdered snow. Oops. We found some powdered snow. So that's good. We found some powdered snow. I was not wearing my leather boots. Okay, let's put those on. And... Yay! Light as a rabbit. Let's grab some of this. Cool. We got powdered snow. Alright. I'm going to take some coordinates. And... There we go. Now we know where we can come to get some powdered snow. There it is. We made it back home. Uh, it's always good to come back and see your base after a long day of exploring. I need to eat. Yeah, there's our wonderful home. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. All right. Let's head inside and place down our spore blossom. After all, that's what this whole journey was for. Let's see. Oh, I got worried I lost it for a second. Alright, let's see. I think this is about the center of the room. Yeah, there's those lovely particles. There we go. There we go. I'm not too big a fan of the dripping ones. I thought there'd be more in the air, but you know what? It's still worth it. It adds a nice atmosphere to the area. And that is where I'm going to have to end today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know we've done a lot of like exploring and cave-related episodes lately, so in the next episode, it will be more of a build typing and less exploring in the caves. So with that being said, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you liked it, make sure to hit the like button, and if you really liked it, make sure to subscribe. My name has been Metallica, and this has been Minecraft. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good one, everybody. Bye-bye.